shoot haul, but it's related to my budgeting videos. Hi, baby. Um, so I know a lot of you guys have been asking to see a video that has to do with grocery shopping and things like that for my budgeting. So I decided today that I would share it with you guys. So now I will just go ahead and show you guys the things I got and I do have the receipt so you guys can see the prices. Let's just get right on into the video. So these are my two receipts that I got. I went to Hy-Vee and Walmart. So there is my total for Hy-Vee. So I got some bananas, celery, lettuce, carrots, avocado, potatoes, and sweet potatoes. And my total for that was, let's see if it'll focus, was $8.35. So that was the stuff I got at Hy-Vee. And then Walmart, I spent, let's see, $22.70. And I got two lactose dairy-free yogurts, a pack of Chipotle vegan burgers, salami. I'm trying to read off this list and I literally, like, I don't know what this is. Um, refried beans, black beans, cranberries, taco shells. Um, I also got, what is that called? Salsa, oh my gosh. Ground turkey and then more snap peas. I don't know if it showed on the list that I got snap peas or if I said that. Oh no, I didn't. Um, I got snap peas at Hy-Vee too, but yeah, so there is how much I spent there. So $22.70 and then $8.35. So around, what is that, $30. So I will go ahead and if I can, if I can tell from the receipt what is what, I'll tell you how much it is. But I did film some at the store to make sure that I showed you guys the exact price. But this head of lettuce, where is it? I'm going to see. Okay, so this was... 119 and then oh god i'm just gonna bring this with me so i pretty much got all my produce at high v she is literally <laughs> so i pretty much got all my produce at high v my celery was let's see 49 cents my carrots were 150 these um here they are so i got three or four um Russet potatoes. I got three avocados. So my potatoes came out to be 87 cents right there. And then my pass, I think that's right, avocados were 38 cents each, coming to 114 for those. And then I got some sweet potatoes. Those costed me, they were three for a dollar. And so I spent 94 cents on those. And mind my nails, I know they are disgusting. I got some bananas for 89 cents. I'm trying to eat bananas. I really don't even like them, but if I cut them up small enough, I'll like them. I don't know. I'm just like, it's a texture thing. If anyone else is like that, comment down below because I feel like I'm really weird that I'm like that, but who knows? But I think, oh, and then I also got these Harvest Snap Green Pea Snack Crisps, and they are the light and creamy Caesar ones. And those came out to 125, but that's all the stuff I got at Hy-Vee, so it was that. And then all of my produce, and sorry if you can hear her meowing in the background, she's so needy. Um, but again, that's what I got at Hy-Vee, the total 835. And then going to Walmart, so I got two things of lactose-free yogurt, and those were 60 cents each. I got this almond milk just because it's a little bit smaller than the ones that are already cold, and I literally have been having a problem drinking all of my almond milk, so I decided to get the smaller one, so I picked up that, and that was $1.94, and then... I picked up some cranberries because I like putting those in my yogurt. If you guys haven't tried it, be sure to because it is so good. And I'm a person that can't eat yogurt by myself. Like, I can if I'm starving, but it just tastes better with something in it. So I either put granola or cranberries in it. That's really good, so you guys definitely try it out. The next thing I got was these garden, garden, gar I don't know, 
uh, chipotle black bean burgers and they are gluten free and I want to say they're vegan don't quote me on that but they are gluten free and they are it's like fake meat but those were they're $3.97 and I did splurge a little bit on these just because there's four burgers in there so it's pretty much four meals for me so it comes out to like cheaper than a dollar so I thought why not and I did pick up another pack of the harvest snaps I did open them in the car because I was literally starving and then those ones were 174 I thought they were more expensive at hy -Vee. that's why I grabbed these ones but now I know those were 174 and then I picked up some hot so not hot sauce it's for tacos um and tip buy the brand that is like the grocery store brand so like great value or if you shop at Kroger the Kroger brand or Meyer things like that their brand ends up being cheaper than like the more famous I guess you could say but that was let's see that was 198 and I don't know if I told you but my cranberries were 164 right there and then I picked up some crunchy taco shells and I usually get the 33 cent ones that are corn tortillas but they have they had none and I was very confused so I had to get these ones because we're having tacos for dinner um, I usually don't spend more than 33 cents on my taco shells but I was really craving them today so my taco shells were a dollar 58 those are gluten free as well it kind of says right there and then to go along with my dinner i grabbed some fat free refried beans again the great value brand because it is cheaper those ones were 88 cents compared to like a dollar or something that all the other brands were but the next thing is i got some hard salami and my salami was $2.98. The next thing I had to grab for my tacos was the McCormick taco se seasoning. What the heck? The gluten-free kind. And this was $0.98. Cents. And then, oh, I almost forgot to show you guys. I did get some black beans too because I'm going to add it in a meal either with salad or rice. With my sweet potatoes, I got, <clears throat> excuse me, the Great Value black beans. And those were... 72 cents and i went ahead and picked up some ground turkey this is 93 percent lean seven percent fat and this pound of ground turkey was about it was 373 so i think i think that is everything that i got i hope i pointed out everything but my total for all of this stuff was again let me double check 31.05 so I would say that is pretty good I mean I am only shopping for myself so this food should last me a while okay guys that was all of my groceries so that is the end of my grocery haul also I want to apologize for the lighting I didn't want to bring my box light out because one I want to do this quick because I do have cold stuff and I want to put it away so it doesn't go bad and there's just not a lot of lighting in here but I thought I would film it for you guys because you guys wanted to see a grocery haul with my budgeting so yeah, that is about it for this video. Don't forget to smash that bell notification so you're notified of my next video. Also, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below for more. Also, if you guys didn't know, I am selling my cash envelopes on Etsy. I will leave my link to my, what do you call it? To my shop below. But again, that is about it. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.